there has been significant amount of debate about whether to use flow or sequencing. I think that uh, the debate is now almost uh, sterile because if we are performing next generation techniques and they reach the same limit of detection, then they are very much comparable. Certainly, each technique has its own set of advantages and disadvantages and you should choose one or the other according to your priorities, resources, as well as sample availability. The most important factor is to choose and to adopt one of the techniques or more than one of the techniques that have been recommended by the International Myeloma Working Group response guidelines. And these are flow using next generation flow developed by Eroflow or sequencing based on the adaptive assay as well as imaging based on PET-CT. It is very important to use the same methodology across studies in order to compare those studies.